Oh man, this video is gonna have <laughs> Harry and Harry's crazy basket bike. Good morning guys. What an eventful night we had last night, if you missed yesterday's vlog. Apparently, I talked to a couple I talked to a couple neighbors this morning on my walk and um, apparently there were three guys. One ran into the woods and they didn't get him. Anyways. Craziness. They got apprehended one. Uh, yeah, I think I heard that they got two. Okay. But Wow. But, anyways. So, and nobody was hurt the whole like one Yeah, as far as we know. I think it might have been a stolen car. I think that might have been. Oh, okay. But they just happened to drive into our Neighborhood. Right, they didn't even. I think they abandoned it outside of our neighborhood. They just happened to run through our neighborhood. Yeah. Hence all the police cars. Okay. Anyways. So I. Oh, that was warmer than I thought. Whoops. What do you What do you got going on here? So look in my pot, and I will explain okay. the story of food, the story that came. Okay. Okay. So onion, carrot, celery. Uh huh. With some bacon grease on the bottom. Sizzle, sizzle. Because bacon grease is essential for soup, right? Oh, yeah. And this is not soup. <laughs> oh, what are you making? I am making chicken pot pie. Nice. With, with turkey. turkey. So okay. turkey pot pie. With turkey homemade bone broth. Oh, man. Which is, there's already some in there and it might be enough, but just in case. So I what do you, and because frozen it, turkey. it looks like soup to me. What do you do yeah. to make it like pot so pie filling? Then I learned this from Glenn and Friends. Oh, yeah. We love Glenn and Friends. So take some butter. I melted it. Oops. And okay. then put flour into it and okay. smooth it up. Okay. And then just add it and it's fine. And it makes kind of like a, it a creamy. Okay. Yeah. Make it thicker. Nice. Um, so that's what I'm doing. Cool. And then I have some pie crusts that are going to go bad soon. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh. Did you take the green pill? No. Guys, I forget to take my allergy. My allergies have been really bad this winter. I Which think. is so strange. Yeah. I, I'm i not quite sure. Although, I always have yeah. during, like, Christmas. I think it's probably the drier air from heating units yeah. that makes, my, makes me cough. Any state we're in, any house we're in. Yeah, but, yeah, I... Anyways, I think I think my allergy medication helps, but I always forget to take it. So we keep it by the coffee because I never forget to take my coffee. <laughs> so, For but it, apply, apparently we? it's not working though. Anyways, thanks for making. Is this for like dinner? It could be now. I don't know. I might have a salad for lunch and yeah. have this for dinner. Sure. Or whatever. And also, I was laying on the couch with Harry, and my watch told me to get up, and I said... No, thank you. But then I did get up, and it's fun. It's like art. Cooking, for me, is like art. Mm. You heard it here first, people. Cooking is like art. It really is. Especially when you don't use a recipe. When you use a recipe, it's like science, and you feel like you're stuck back in high school science lab but when you throw out the recipe you can feel the freedom do to, to do art with your food let's see how this goes oh nice so this is just butter and flour that you're adding in there yeah interesting usually i would do it in the pan like a roux mm -hmm. and then add the broth but i wanted to do it a different way plus my broth was frozen <laughs> Nice. There's that. So then I'll probably turn it up slightly. Okay. Simmer it until it looks like I want it to, and I'll taste it, and then throw it together. Okay. I'm going to take this before I forget. Good idea. Okay, here's where I'm at so far. Four tiny overflowing pot pies. There's another pot pie down in there. And then this is a... So basically I had some of the mixture left over. And I was like, okay, extra mixture. The uh, chicken pot pie mixture. And I was like, what do I do with this? Well, I had a little bit of a bag of egg noodles 
that I wanted to use up. So I thickened the sauce a little bit. I basically used it as, as a cream of chicken soup can. You know when you're gonna make a casserole, it always says can of cream of mushroom soup or cream of chicken soup. Well, those sorts of cans of soup type things make Peter and I have stomach aches and possibly blazing diarrhea as well. So we stay away from those, but I still, whenever I see somebody making a casserole on like a cooking video or something, I'm like, I want a casserole. So I used my pot pie mix as my cream of chicken. And I cooked some egg noodles up, just like al dente, and then put those in the cream sauce. And then I sprinkled some Parmesan cheese on top and then I did some panko breadcrumbs with butter so it'll get real crispy on top. Hopefully it's gonna be good. So I gotta see if I can get these chicken pot pies out of this cupcake. Oh yeah, 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 there it goes. Okay, let's see, oh yeah, oh yeah. Okay, is this one gonna come out? Oh, hi there. I just found them in the cabinet. Yep. <laughs> yep. Okay, I'm gonna try to revive the, ooh. Hello. I'm gonna try to revive this <laughs> lettuce here. <laughs> okay, look. It's coming out. It's coming out. Okay, there it is. Ta da! Peter's trying to pop pie. Mm. Yeah, that's good. Yay. I ate one as well. And then here's our bigger pot pie and our noodle casserole. I feel like this goes without saying, but we're not gonna eat all this food today. It's meal prep for other days as well. <laughs> oh, I just came down the stairs and found Mary and saw this laundry basket. I was like, is she folding laundry while she does her therapy and exercises? And then I come around and I see this. Harry boy is under here in the basket. Oh my goodness. So... So what's the inspiration for the basket well, on your exercise bike? When I'm exercising on this, he'll come close to the pedals, pedals and it's danger. Because he wants he wants and to he, snuggle. Yeah, and I'll stop and he'll stand up and stretch on me. And I'm like, I can't really hold you while I'm doing this. So I just realized that this basket fits on the frame here. Oh my goodness, and you used some zip ties to put it on there? Mm-hmm. And this is just what was sitting there next to. Actually, yeah, that pile of clothes I need to put away. Got it. Good work. So. And great ingenuity. Would to... you be able to grab my slippers from the, that room over there? Mm-hmm. Oh my, what's, what, what's <laughs> happening? Harry's been coming on walks with us. Oh my. Guys, it's slightly embarrassing. It is, but we usually don't see people. <laughs> it's like, we want him to come with us. We've tried it on his harness. He cannot. Well, that was during the summer. It's actually pretty cute and fun that all four of us come on a walk. Yeah, it's super fun. Do you love that your brother comes on a walk with us? Yeah. It's just, if his head's sticking out and we see somebody, it's kind of embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> Just but. saying. It yeah, just so it, it doesn't work if he's on the harness. Oh, yeah, no. But Plus wearing him works. Yeah. He loves being all snuggled up. I mean, look at him. He's just got his eyes closed. He's in my hoodie. And then I have a baby carrying thing on, which in our case is a cat carrier. And then a blanket and then a coat. Nice. Just taking an afternoon stroll. Kind of a dreary day, but it's not well, too bad out. Oh, the bluebird. Yeah, that was beautiful. And then there's geese. Oh yeah. We just got back from our walk. Yes. And I literally said to Peter, oh man, this video is gonna have <laughs> Harry coming on our walk in our cat carrier and Harry's crazy basket bike. I was like, we're just gonna have to call this vlog crazy cat people. I think you said we should call it. We love our cat. <laughs> and then I thankfully instantly remembered 
There are so many Sphinx people whose Sphinxes are also so loving. I saw a post from a Sphinx person, meaning a person who has a Sphinx, and it was a picture of the cat in their hoodie, and they were like, any moment he can possibly get in my hoodie, or something like that, and then they said, anybody else? <laughs> and I'm like, yeah. <laughs> I get it. I get it. Hmm. Well, we love you, buddy. Ollie, what do you think when Harry comes on a walk? Is that the craziest thing? Did you have such a good walk? You did. I'm pretty excited. Um, let us just say. I tried the gummy glucose tabs from Walmart. Raspberry, strawberry, and blueberry. They are so good. But they're, they're pretty expensive, so I had a gift card to Walmart, so I was like, I'm gonna try them. They're good. Look what Peter made us. This looks amazing. Triple Decker burger. Because we only had one bun, so we were gonna split it, so he, I was like, I'm just gonna load up the meat. I, I think it might be a oh, little big. That's so I mean, big. But we'll see how this goes down. Yum. And Peter wins. What do I win? You did the dishes. Oh, well, I'm still working on it. I'm working on it. You win. Yeah. Oh yeah, I need to give Ollie his flea and heartworm drugs. So, Ollie, you want treats? <laughs> Come here, Bones. Don't a special? Hello? Bonesy. Do you want this treat? Oh, you do? Oh, I see your tail. Oh, does that mean you want it? Don't want the treat? Okay, come here. I have to hype him up for this. He likes, he doesn't love it, but he likes it if I hype him up. Ollie, ready? You want it? You want it? Come here, let me hype you up. <laughs> Eight-year-old doggy doesn't want to stand up. Okay, well, I will give him his treats in a little while. Literally two seconds later. Okay, now you want your treaties? Wave. Wow, that's a good one. Is it pretty? Is it pretty? <laughs> Some dogs can sit pretty for a long, long time. Is it pretty? Oops, good try. And some dogs' body shapes or maybe ab muscles, I don't know, doesn't really work. Okay, wait, let me put it on your nose. Okay, oops, not yet. I didn't, I didn't put it down yet. Here, you gotta put your head this way. Okay, ready, set, go. Good boy! <laughs> right here, sit. All right, let's see. Can you stand up, big one? Oh, is it good boy? How about this one? Do the little shaky thing, high five. I don't have a hand, so you'll have to do my knee. Now sit pretty and use my balance to help you. Here, do it again. Yeah, do that. This one. <laughs> Big one. Shake. There's a good boy. Sit pretty. There you go. I'll be your balancer. Okay. There you go. There's a good boy. And as always, see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow, guys. Mmm, delicious. Good night. <laughs>